Hello, what's up guys? Today I'm going to show you how you can go ahead and buy a mobile operations center and I'm going to show you the requirements because you will need something to actually be able to buy it. Now, let's go ahead and start off. Now, first of all, what you do is you go over to the internet first and once you go to the internet, you go over to Maze Bank foreclosure. So make sure it's foreclosure Maze Bank and not this one. These are two different things. So let's go over here, enter the site. Once you enter the site, you want to go over to here. Click on bunkers and you will be able to only see the bunkers over here. So I recommend you guys to get something here, middle ground or here. If you have a lot of money, actually, how much money does that even cost? Actually, these are the most expensive ones. So get what, whichever location you want. If you want the cheap one, you can get this one, but it's a bit too far from the city though. So I'm going to show you now what to do once you do get them. So let's go ahead and pretend we're getting this. So you can just go ahead and buy it without any customizations to it. Just buy it with that price. Once you do get it, you want to go over to tra travel and transport. And then you want to go over to Warsaw. You do need a bunker to be able to buy the mobile operations center, guys. Otherwise, it's not going to work. So go over here and then you will be able to buy it. I'm also going to show you how to request for one. So you can just customize it on however you want it. Just do whatever you want. Add whatever you want. Just do whatever you want to it. So now I'm going to show you how to request for it. So let's go ahead and request. <coughs> so let's go ahead and request. You basically open your interaction menu, service vehicles, and then you go ahead and go here and request mobile operation center. On the map, it will look like this. Go here. <coughs> so let's go down there. And there you go. It's pretty dark, but I can actually barely see it. Nowhere to put my heli. So now I want to tell you about customizing your mobile operation center and how you can actually do this. So the first way is renovating it from your internet like I showed you guys earlier. But the second way is doing it in your bunker. So if you want to respray it, if you want a different color for it, if you want something like very different for it, you can. So what you need to basically do is you need to go to your bunker and in your bunker you will be able to modify your mobile operation center so it's really easy and it's really quick you can like modify a lot of stuff about this too and it's very powerful like it can really take a lot of damage but it won't go through a lot of places but there's one tip if you really want to have like fun with this you just hold on the right d-pad just detach this and then you can basically have a lot of fun with this basically you also have some couple options, so let's go over to service vehicles. And then you can go over to mobile operation center. And you can do stuff like empty trailer to force all players out of your cab, your trailer, change radio. And you can also change the access so whoever you want them to use it. <coughs> and also just stuff like that. You can also enter the behind of it too, so make sure that there's not too many people. Sometimes you won't be able to enter it when there's like cars nearby, so make sure there's not a lot of cars nearby. And over here you can do a lot of stuff. Use even like the gun turrets. If you bought them, of course, you can request your, I mean, use your armory. You can use this, which is pretty interesting if you're fighting enemies. But I would recommend you guys to use the Avenger if you're fighting enemies. 
because the things are a little bit better. Let me see, actually. I think they're equally good. No, they're not equally good. The Avenger one shoots a little bit faster. And I think you can also change the Avenger one too. And this is also pretty slower. So I want to see. Okay, it directly kills. That's a good thing. It's just not that fast. Yeah, the Avenger is like... 10 levels ahead than this one. It sh like shoots a lo lot faster. It can fly, you can engage autopilot into the sky. And you can just do it from the sky. And you can do it also from like very far away. I don't know about this one. Can this do it from far away? I don't see the shots. I don't think so. Let's try it somewhere else. Should be able to hit this building easily. Okay, dead. Let's try this building. The zoom in is not that good though. Will it hit? I don't think so. Yeah, it didn't hit. Or maybe I just need to zoom in more, but I can't. It's pretty fun though. <laughs> Anyways, this is how you can basically buy a uh, mobile operation center. I just couldn't stop. Anyways, you can also leave it from there. You can do a lot of stuff. You can even upgrade your weapons if you did buy it, the options for it. You can upgrade your uh, cars, your weaponized cars from Warstock. You can add like weapons to it. You can do so many stuff here. Yeah, the customizations are endless here. But if you have a choice between an Avenger and a mobile operation center, Guys, please choose the Avenger though. But if you don't have a lot of money, you can also get a mobile operation center. Or if you just want to get both, because you just have the money for it, just sure, why not? That's what I did. So yeah. Thank you for watching guys. Please like, subscribe, and take care. Goodbye. And also if you want to add me, I'm gonna show you my username. So if you want to play with me, you can add this account over here. And for the Xbox users, you can add this account over here. So we can play together basically. And now, let's go ahead and I want to show one thing. I want to show the weapons. And I want to show you it, when you can upgrade it. So you can basically upgrade these. Just click here. And like you see, it's already upgraded. So you need to buy the upgrade for it. You can also refer it to, it's for free. But the upgrade is going to cost you money, but after that, it's basically for free, so you don't need to pay anymore. And yeah, that's basically the video. Thank you for watching, guys. Please like, subscribe, and don't forget to add me. Take care.